Hey guys, this is an update on the X900 uh, frame from Hobby King. Uh, I did a review on it, on the frame earlier and I wasn't too happy about it. I saw some weak spots um, and it turned out I was right. Uh, the tail mount, motor mount broke off on not that hard of a landing. Um, but I bought some um, nice aluminium mount, uh, motor mounts uh, on eBay. Probably some guy just doing them on his CSC machine at home, but uh, they're pretty good. Uh, I only put that, uh, this one on the tail, so, you know, drop me a comment if you want to have a link to his uh, shop. Um, I use uh, Multistar 30 amp uh, ESCs. Um, they're pretty nice and they can be flashed with the Simon K uh, firmware. Uh, if you're up to that, you should definitely do that. Um, it will make the whole uh, tricopter more stable. And on the motors, I'm using these NTM 2836 750 kV uh, motors from Hobby King. Pretty nice motors. You could also use something like the DT750, but I just don't like the look of them. But uh, they're pretty nice anyway, for whatever reason you might prefer to use those. But you know, I just think this. You know, give a little nicer look, so to speak. The props, uh, the cheap one from Hobby King, this, these green ones, 10 by 4, 7, I think. But they are a little too, you know, flexible. So I'll change them out to some APC styles, like these. They're a little more stiff in it, so maybe that would give the tricop a little more oomph, so to speak. Um, what else? I'm using the KK2 board with the LED. It's a pretty cheap board. I had it lying around and I was, you know, urging to try to play around with it because I'm using normally MultiV uh, uh, Mega Pirate, but I thought this would be a nice little uh, frame to uh, to try it on. And it actually is a nice light controller for what it is. So if you don't want to spend too much money, you should definitely uh, look into that. Um, a free sky and cameras, I don't want to go into that. Um, this is definitely uh, a very nice um, frame if you set it up. I know I was a little uh, about it the first time, but it's pretty nice. With this setup and this battery, uh, the Nanotech 3 cell, uh, 3300 milliamp, um, I get about 7 minutes. I could 80% discharge, uh, by math it would give me 8.7 minutes. I don't want to drive it to the very end, so seven minutes, I'm happy about that. Um, and I do know that if something happens and I have to go a little over seven minutes, um, it won't drain the battery completely. I like to have a little safety margin. Um, but I, I still think seven minutes is a pretty nice uh, flying time. Uh, this is not a frame where we go like 10 miles or anything like that, so for a little, you know, Light cruising, uh, this is definitely a, a nice little frame. And if you fly a line of sights, uh, seven minutes is more than enough. Um, but you have any questions um, or anything else you want to know, please drop me a comment and uh, I will get back to you as soon as I can. But uh, this is the setup I'm using, so hope you enjoyed this. Have a nice day.